Dum 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 dum. Dum 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 dum. Dum 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 dum. Dum 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 dum. My name is Ama Santoa Diaka. My stage name is Poet Rasantoa and I'm a poet and sometimes a singer. Um, my artistic process involves being hounded or curious or intrigued by something that's happening to me, people around me or the environment I am in or in the world, but mostly in my community. Something triggers my interest and then I go through the process of writing about it, researching about it, thinking about it and then writing rewriting, writing, rewriting, till I get perfect material that I think is ready to be shared. I applied to be part of the New International Voices, partly because of who was organising it. The UK is known to have a rich theatre history, and in exploring ways in which I could present my work such that it is memorable to the audience days after they've watched it, I wanted a place that has, has had history of theatre. The residency has been great and overwhelming as well. Um, there's been so much to take in. Maybe the first few days I came, I had an idea of a work, but after watching a certain show, I went back to the drawing board to try and see something that I could do better. In Ghana, we have to work with our bodies and our voice because th those are the props and we have to work with it. But here, there's so much more. There's, Everything is being used from technology to props to buildings to everything is being used and it's been such an eye-opener to one, realise that and to also realise how far we've achieved with the little that we have and how far we can go. My collaboration with Kwame, Kwame is a movement artist um, and I'm a poet so it, it sounds like what possibly could you do and, and Kwame is the kind of artist who reacts to the things in his environment to produce the work that he does. It was a very a beautiful experience to watch him react to it for every rehearsal. Like for every rehearsal there's a different reaction and it just tells you about like how our artistic processes are so different but when they are performed it all fuses together to become something beautiful. One of the shows we watched that I loved was Goldfish Bowl which was by Khaled Femi who's a poet. It was such an experience to watch all of these things and to be able to watch and say, okay, this is something that I could translate differently and use it in my work, or how this work transitioned to this is, was very interesting. Maybe I don't, I've never done that, but I could try that for my next work. And, and so I, I like that watching these things feed into my own artistic process. The residency gave the the appeal that the artist would have the space and the time to explore on their own. And I wanted that space to come out of a familiar place, to come to a different place and look at things more critically. And so it's been quite interesting and challenging and a bit terrifying, but good experience. Let's go. I'm on a roll. I only need a dollar in my pocket.